Hey Booski, it's me. Why did I say that? Like I'm leaving a message to you. I don't know. Um, hello, it's Thursday. I almost forgot it was Thursday, but then I remembered. So here I am. You're welcome. Um, I am filming this completely blind because I wasn't going to put in my contacts, but the glasses give off a weird glare. So that's happening right now. Um, I'm really tired. <laughs> I have... I thought I knew I had two tests next week on Wednesday and Thursday. I found out on Tuesday that I have a test on Tuesday as well. So I have a test in all of my math classes next week. Um, and like training, I finish training on Sunday. So I work tomorrow, Saturday, Sunday. Um, have Monday the day to study. Monday night is a review session I have to go to because last time I skipped the review session, I missed a quiz. Um, then Tuesday's a test. Wednesday's a test, Thursday's a test, and Thursday is also an appointment that I made today with an oral surgeon. Awesome. <laughs> I went to the dentist today, like you did, you went to the dentist, and now I have gone to the dentist. And um, he, I sat in the chair for like five minutes, and he looked at my x-ray, and he's like, oh yeah, that needs to be extracted. Um, here's a referral to an oral surgeon. Okay, thanks, bye. And then he was like, I'm surprised your mouth hasn't like ballooned up and take some antibiotics. And when you have had the oral surgery, which is just the tooth, they're taking it out. They're just, there's a crown on this tooth and they're extracting the tooth. Um, and then I don't know, I guess I'm going to need to get an implant. Um, but so he's like, after they've done that, you need to come back because you have two other teeth down here and I'm surprised they haven't made your mouth ballooned up. Which is like, great, awesome. I'm so excited for that. Um, so once I'm done with all of my tests, then I'm going to go have oral surgery. Oral, oral, oral surgery. Um, so that's awesome. I'm super excited about it. Um, yeah, so this week has been hard. Um, just a lot of studying and... My teeth are kind of, my tooth is kind of starting to hurt, and so that's why I went to the dentist. And then he was like, "You needs to go, the oral surgeon." Mm, I'm really tired. I haven't been taking any naps, and I think it's kind of dawning on me like I don't have any days off anymore. So we'll see. We'll see how that all works. Um, after the dentist, I went to Epcot today. We rode the mail. We rode the Maelstrom for the last time, probably, which is the ride in Norway. They're getting rid of it. It's going away Sunday, I believe. Um, so we rode that, and I got some food, food and wine. And then we came home, and now I need to take a shower and get ungrody, and then I need to um, study more. <laughs> so yeah, life is great. Um, things are good, other than you know, the stress, things are good. I have no idea how long I've been talking because I can't see the clock. I'm going to just, I'm gonna just, oh, three minutes. Okay. Um, but, you know, just hanging in there. Gilmore Girls is on Netflix, so I've just kind of been binge watching that while I study, which has been really good. And watching New Girl, and so that's good. And, I mean, it's fine. Everything's fine. It's just, I'm looking forward to next week being over. Um, and then probably the next week can calm down a little bit, maybe sleep in on my days when I don't have to get up early for class and then, you know, it'll be good. But yeah, so that's basically it. I'm not going to make this be till five minutes because I have a shower to take and studying to do and laundry to do and eating to happen. And then I'm Skyping with Pearson at like midnight. <laughs> And then I'm going to bed, and then I'm going to get up and go to work, and then I'm going to take surveys for eight hours, and it's going to be great. Um, so just let me put these on. Um, I love you a lot. Uh, we'll talk to you later. Bye.